You may have heard that on October 18th, 2024, Oris announced a new line of divers' watches. I was invited to a preview of this announcement the night before. This event was held at the Orological Society of New York, supported by the Oris's partner, Heaven Hill Distillery. I'll introduce you to this new set of watches on this episode of Adventures with Time. Oris first introduced their line of divers' watches back in the mid-1960s. About 10 years ago, for the 50th anniversary of that launch, they came out with a line of retro-styled watches called the Oris Diver 65. Over the past decade, they've introduced several varieties of this line. Now, Oris has created the Diver's Date line of watches, an updated approach to the Air Diver's watches. What makes these watches different? I'll let Rolf Studer, Oris's global co-CEO, and VJ Geronimo, Oris's CEO of the Americas, tell you while I show you. Um, I know it's a very busy weekend in New York with all the watch things going on. Very exciting for everyone. We have some exciting things to show you tonight. It's about divers. For those of you who know the brand, we, we do a lot of work in divers watches and divers are very much a part of who we are. I'd like to introduce a special guest who made his way. This is Rolf Studer, our global co-CEO, who made it in from Switzerland just now. When we think about Diver 65, nine years, what was going on at the time when Diver 65 was released? It was the beginning of the retro trends in watches and we were quite early to that. They overcame the watch crisis and um, they want to look towards the future, do new things, not look back. But nevertheless, we got Diver 65 at the time done and it was uh, more or less an instant success. It also gave us a chance to talk about the history of Oris and who we are and who we were at that time in a very natural way. Originally, Diver 65 was a retro watch, right? Reference to the original watch from the 1960s. Diver 65, as you said, has its firm place in the Oris collection. So we also want to evolve to Diver's 65 range. Now it has a new name. It's Divers, only Divers, because it's not a retro watch anymore. It's a classic watch. The first thing you will recognize is maybe uh, the ceramic footprint then you will um, see more polished elements on the watch. A new font that's exclusive to um, divers now that has been developed. You will see that the bracelet is redesigned to less retro, more modern. It is 200 meters waterproof now, but as it was uh, 100 meters. Diver 65 has a closed case back in multiple cases with uh, the vintage logo on it. Now it has an open case back. New proportions on the case has a new crown, has different grip, offering a new um, improved class. A lot of things changed to keep it an Oris Divers, but still bring it um, into a new era for it. Um, more of a classic and not a retro watch. <laughs> Not only that, but the watch also comes with two straps. And the retail price is $2,700. US Hey, how do you like this new watch enthusiast apparel? Available now in my store, accessible just below this video window. Now that you've heard from the brand, let me give you my opinion of these new watches. Usually I ask Oris to borrow new releases so that I can study them in the quiet of my home and provide you the best in detailed reviews. Having been invited to attend this pre-release event, I decided to shoot my video there in the Bergier Library of the Orological Society of New York. Each dial color has its own characteristics. The black dial is stark and presents an understated conservative appearance. The blue dial softens that look a bit, making it perhaps more suitable in a casual environment. The brown dial is more playful, with the contrasting dark bezel against the lighter dial. Switching to the black rubber strap that comes with each of these watches converts the brown dial into a watch suitable for any sporting event. But you decide which color and strap option is more to your liking. Oris has successfully updated the Diver 65 with this Diver's Date model. 
it is a modern all-round watch that works well in any wearing scenario and meets the needs of most watch enthusiasts. Yes, you could go with a more toolish diver's model like the Aquas Date, available with the Caliber 733 and the in-house Caliber 400. Or you could get the Big Crown Pointer Date for a more stylish appearance. However, if you're looking for an everyday watch that, as Oris touts, has that classic styling, you should consider this new Oris Diver's Date. Another watch brand that has recently updated their diver's watch is Nomadic out of Belfast, Ireland. Take a look at this video to learn about their new Mirai 401 version 2. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video.